All right, Staff for Eric Plays, Witcher 2, Episode 14. All right, so when we last left off, I was, I had just finished in the dungeon, and it was time to get out of the dungeon. So I need to get out and go talk to Philippa. So let's see if we can figure that out. Um, let's see. It's very dark in here. Alright. There we go. I imagine there may be monsters again. I'm not sure. Because I did have to kill them all on the way in. Uh, return to surface. Right, get out. Looks like it's all over. Thanks for your help, Zoltan. Say nothing of it. Enough yapping. Time for some vodka. First, I want to see if my fuck date's still waiting. Just don't mm. strain yourself. It takes energy to drink with us too, you know. That's pretty funny. Hmm. <laughs> Alright. Alright, I turned off the extra elements on the game just to see if that helps the frame rate at all. Let's see. Yeah, it seems to. Okay, well that that'll be helpful for um what you might call it uh when I play uh Hitman as well. Yeah, it seems to be it's not quite hitting thirty, but it seems to be, let's see, so it's doing Oh. Uh oh. This may be some rated R stuff going on here. Oh, nope. Ha uh, fake out. It was just a massage. What is it, Witcher? Who is that girl? Cynthia, a leashed sorceress. What does that mean? That sounds bad. Yeah, that's what I was just saying. Use <laughs> muzzles. Leash means a connection between a sorceress and her assistant. An unfortunate term, I admit, but it explains how things are. Cynthia can tap my power, use my spells. She's a conduit. And she's learning along the way. Sure. It's convenient, and except for the name, not derisive at all. But you're not here to talk about Cynthia. Nope. At the council, you mentioned artifacts were needed to undo the curse. Hmm. But I can't look for them now. I know. I have them. I can do that. I did that. Why? I have my reasons. Tell me something. Did you notice? Not all the ghosts were aggressive. Yes. Most just disappeared when they touched the aura of a living person. I think the curse corrupts the ghosts of the fallen and turns them into draugers. I wonder that if that's a thing that already exists in, in um, draugers in are Polish of war. They arise at sites of exceptionally vicious, bloody battles. Their bloodlust and hatred in condensed form. Hmm. Can you kill them by conventional means? A silver sword is enough for a draugr. I've got one of those. As long as the curse remains active, new ones will arise. The soldier's ghosts are the key. If I could turn the tide of the battle... For that, you'll need symbols of war belonging to those who fell in battle. Hatred, death, courage, and faith. All artifacts must be magically active and connected to the fallen, or they won't lure the ghosts. Right. I'll look around. Finding two will be enough. Get the symbols of hatred and death and leave the rest to me. Hmm. I'd prefer Your quest and faith. Don't fuss. I'll see what I can do. Cecil seems to know a lot about the area. Oh, you know, um, Philippa, I've... This is Philippa because they told me to go to her. Um, I like that card in Gwent. It's like 4-3-2-1 damage. Know anything about blood curses? Do you? We're dealing with a fourth level curse, also known as the Curse of the Archmistress. Well, well. I'm impressed. Thing is, until now I thought it was only a myth, that such a curse couldn't be cast. You thought wrong. There are six confirmed cases of this curse being inflicted. What about confirmed cases of it being lifted? One. Achieved by a team of sorcerers led by Archmistress Francesca Finderbear, hence the curse's other name. Sabrina Gleverzig was on the team. Small world. 
That's not all. The curse investigated by Francesca and Sabrina was designed to end the Tyson dynasty, the rulers of Kovir. They were cursed by Scarlet Rodelega, a complete madman, but very talented. And Eclipse and Wraiths also accompanied his curse. So Sabrina's curse is just a knockoff Rodelega. Exactly. Can Francesca's experience help us? Certainly. I know the symbols and the workings of the curse thanks to her. Care to explain? I'm the one risking my neck. You'll have to relive the battle and change its course at the right moment. Not fun. I don't know Not cool. exactly what will happen. Nobody does. Huh. I'll look for those artifacts. What happened here three years ago? Henselt attacked Edurn, but met his match. Nobody won that war. Sabrina Glefesig got into a conflict with the Commander-in-Chief of the Kedweni forces, and this led to both armies being rooted. Fireballs turned the battlefield into a flaming tomb. Henselt accused Sabrina of using a forbidden weapon. And Sabrina cursed Henselt. I think so. I suspect the curse got out of hand because of the circumstances. Circumstances? The stars weren't right, wrong phase of the moon. There's always an excuse for simple bungling. She placed the curse while burning at the stake. Her hands and feet nailed to a wagon wheel. I'd say she did a good job considering. Dang. I'm good for now. I'll let you know when I learn something. Wait, I think I still want to talk to her though. You wanted to discuss something. I'm looking for Triss. Letho forced her to teleport near Vergen. Letho? Voltest's killer. Perhaps Demavend's too. Will you help me find her? Certainly. We sorceresses must stick together. We have too many enemies. Triss contacted you through Sheila de Tanzerville's megascope while in Flotsam. And I haven't heard from her since. Can you locate her? A megascope responds to a person's aura. If I had something of hers, I could find her. You were close to her. Maybe you have something. No, I don't have anything. Not good. Wait, a local drunkard claims he saw a redhead fall out of the sky. What? This could be a lead. <laughs> there are many redheads. Perhaps they're just drunken delusions. It's possible, however, that an unstable teleport ejected Triss near the town. Sure. As it's our only lead, I'll talk to this drunkard. Do you know him? I'm not used to associating with drunkards, but you'll likely find him in the inn. Thank you. Come back as soon as you learn anything. Alright. Let's see. I think there's you still a little more. Um, let's see. I found an immortel. Excellent. Alright. Hey, don't lay down. I was talking to you. Alright, let's see here. So right now we've got hunting magic. So I need royal blood. Okay. I've got this other stuff going on. All right. So I guess Let's talk to the dwarf. Oops, did I end up working? That is what I'm working on. All right, so we'll talk to the dwarf. Um, let's see. I'm going to see if I can drop to... I think I had set up a profile for recording Witcher that might make a better recording. All right, I think I had set up the streaming profile to be a little bit easier on the game. Yeah, it looks like I'm keeping 30. No, nope, maybe not, but. Wonder if the Microsoft stuff has reared its head again. Um, like maybe when I had an update recently, it turned it back on.
Okay. Okay. All right, we'll talk to this dwarf. See what's up. Oh. Let's see. Gotta get over there. Gotta go around. There we go. Not that guy. All right. And into here. Let me tell you about the woman who fell Look, from the sky. Another one. Where? You let one you human in that story at a thousand times. This guy? I heard you saw something interesting. As clearly as I see you. Amazing. I look into the sky. But wait. You must buy a fellow a drink for such a story. Well, you shut it already. We could already cite this bullshit mm. now. I'm a client and I'll say what I want. Pour me some Mahakam and mead and no cheating. This noble wayfarer will pay. Hmm. Hi. I'm a little short right now. Let me tell you about the woman. Oh, all right, let me try that again. How can I help? See nope, again. let's try again. I heard you. Yes, but wait. Well, you sh I'm a... All right, I'll pay. How much is it supposed to cost? Oh, and you say cost 23, I guess? I'll pay, but if you bore me, I'll shove this meat up your ass. Mm. You're such a fine liquor, and my ass has no taste. <laughs> you won't regret it. Mm. Speak. Last week, I was passing by the gullies. I like to take a hike from time to time. Get to the point. I like that the bartender rolled his eyes. So I'm walking, and suddenly there's a flash. A crack. I'm thinking, a storm's coming, but nearly a cloud in the sky. You hit the ground with your arse so hard you saw a flash. You were that drunk. Then I saw people lying in a gully as if they'd fallen from the sky. A man and a woman. The woman was so beautiful, I wished she'd fallen down on me. Huh. What did the woman look like? A redhead. Wearing a vest and high shoes with pert tits and a round arse. Just waiting to be grabbed and... Oh. You said it just like your old lady. Shut your mouth! What happened then? Well, the woman was hurting, couldn't get up. The man clearly disliked her, because he didn't help her. He just stood there, menacing and talking. And then he left, and the redhead stayed. Noticed her tits, and didn't even try to help her, you sod. I was about to do exactly that when a troll came out of the gully. Ugly as shit after blueberries. Did it attack her? Not at all. I hid and saw everything. First he sniffed her, so I thought he'd eat her. But he didn't. He threw her over his shoulder like a Seems weird that it would be Triss, because why would the guy who kidnapped her just walk away? Yes. Didn't waste your money, as you'll agree. Alright, gotta search the ravines now. I'm gonna try one more thing to see if I can improve this recording uh, quality. All right, I dropped it to. I changed the encoder to ultra fast and dropped the quality a little bit. Let's see if that does any better. All right, let's see here. Go out of here towards the ravines. Try anything. Eh, may just be the case that there's nothing I can really do about it. Eh, the system's just not set up for for that. I mean, I thought I had a powerful enough system, but I guess not when you're doing a game like this. Fair, to be fair, it is slightly jerky for me, too. Alright, where am I? Let's see, can I jump? Nope. Gotta keep going around, I guess. That's ominous. Strange. 
Well, assisting, huh? Is there a way around it? Let's be going this way. Oh. I certainly am. I want to be part of this right now. Where the heck am I supposed to be? Fix. Go this way. It's definitely not the way up. Let's see. Looks <coughs> like I went the wrong way. I'm trying to find. I'm here. Whoa, I'm supposed to be way over there? With flickering heart. Is that right? Yep. Yep. No, this is. This is a different one. Oh. I want to go to this one. Let's see, map. Okay, know? so that's kind of close. Are you the orange guy? Yeah. Let's go back this way. Alright, that's the city. We'll go to the ravines. Let's see, where am I now? I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Let's see. Hold on. Okay, this way, I guess. I thought I was, go I was going this way, and that's not where I wanted to be. Let's see. Yeah, this is where the evil creatures were before. Maybe I can get around it by going this way? No, nope, because it doesn't let me jump down. I don't know. Let's see. Going the wrong way! Yeah, kind of. Maybe I just have to go around it. Let's see. It is, huh? It's a wraith. It's a type of ghost. Alright, here we go. Is that where the monsters spawn? Yeah, I don't... I wanna go this way. What is... See That's a cool man. Is that your house? Yeah. We got here. Sardine. Alright. Here we are. Whoa. It's a an ogre. Yeah. Oh there. A witcher. Bumpkins wishes sent to be killed. So be kill quick. No pay. First tell me, where's the woman you kidnapped? Kidnap none! I troll! A dwarf saw you carrying a human woman. Me stupid. Sick she, me carry. Her help, feet, pet. But she run go. Mrs. First run go. Redhead girl. All gone. Mm. Soup only stay. What's in the pot? Soup. Elf and onion. <coughs> Good. One try? Hmm. Tell me, troll, what happened here? Me in Gullies, Mrs. in Gullies. Why did you choose that? Bones found. Mm. Nice Why to know. You... And what? Humus you... from sky you... fall. You're a lying, troll. People don't fall from the sky. <laughs> troll, true tell. Flash crack. Two humans drop where Dumble ship. Humi man, big as troll. And woman. Why is he called human? I go <laughs> see. Was the man bald? Did he have a scar? Wish a man likes man. <laughs> See, I from far. Bald, yes. Scar, no see. <laughs> Run he go to Gullies. 
Leave redhead human down. See, I go. Redhead grow. Is he talking? Mm hmm. Her pace. Closer, I creep. Run, she not go. Make her grow. Take Does it have another eye? This one eye? Go home. Miss is angry. Consume me when thin bones. Huh. Hungry, Miss. <coughs> yap and yap. Then run, go own for food. <coughs> give water, red mm -hmm. Leaves cover them. Humi redhead nice. <laughs> Pet she when <laughs> sleeps. Redhead have kerchief. Nice to sneeze. Conkerchief. Mrs. Come kerchief? back. Elves in hand. Drop thin wench. Eat it, she calls. Mrs. Yap. Rag give. Troll say not. Nice to feel. Stench troll like. Mrs. Say, she <laughs> Troll think. Nice redhead. Nice rag stench. Troll, Mrs. Tell. Mrs. Troll with log beat and run go. Even left elves. What happened to the redhead? Redhead, wrong pain. Redhead stay. Is he hey, gone. Redhead run go. Uh, so he doesn't know where she went because she left when he was sleeping. Daddy? Mm. Is he a troll or is he a human that is cursed? He's a troll. Do you still have the redhead's bandana? No. Missy's take away. Old bug leave elves, rag, steel, Where did she go? Mrs. That's his wife. Wife. Girl is. Mrs. Gully's like. She ran away. Mm -hmm. Gully's me like. Human? Why don't I look for her? Wish her Mrs. No kill. Good old bug. Little batty. I won't hurt your woman. Mrs. Tell come back. Below. We terrible. Wind howl empty. Maybe that's his name? I'll tell your mate to come back, but I need the redhead's bandana. Mrs. have. Mrs. good. She up give. As soon as she back. Before, when you first met him, I thought he was... Alright, so now I need to convince his wife to come back. But not this time. That'll be next time. This has been Eric Plain Witcher 2. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.